Hello everybody and welcome. Today we have got something a little bit different. Now this wasn't cut from a stream this time. I wanted to do this on the stream but didn't really know where the time to fit it in. Um, so I'm just recording it. It's not a game. If you are aware the Met Gala was on. I, I don't honestly no idea what it is. Looks like a massive fancy dress. Um, so we're going to be just essentially looking through at some of these celebrities who, I'll be honest, not going to know who any of them are. Um, and just having a look at their costumes, I guess, because from what I've seen, it, it's, it's, a, it's a Tim Burton movie just waiting to happen. But yeah, we're going to go through, we're going to laugh, and we're, we're going to rate them out of 10 as well. You know, we're, we're going to give them a nice rating. Um, so yeah, without further ado, let's get into our our first first Met Gala costume. Okay, so, so, <laughs> right. I'll be honest, from a couple of bits that I've seen on Twitter, it's not the worst. <laughs> she looks like the Enchantress from the Suicide Squad. That's all I can say about this one. It's pretty horrendous. It's t it, it's horrendous. <laughs> I also just saw a funny looking woman on the right there as <laughs> well. This is going to be long. This is going to be real long. Uh, and it, does it say who these people are? Okay, that was Bella. Had, had Who again? Whoever that was. I don't know. Who is the Emma Corrin in custom Mew Mew and... Jesus Christ. Remember at the beginning of the video when I said it's a Tim Burton movie? <laughs> waiting to happen. This is exactly what I meant. This is horrendous. Like... Is she, is she here to perform a magic show? Is, is is that what's happening? Is she actually a celebrity? Is this Harry Potter? Because like that really looks like a pull a rabbit out of the hat hat. You know what? It it's it's a lot worse than this. It's a lot worse. <laughs> so you know what? We're gonna bump this up. This is a five. This is is a three. The hat though is a ten. The hat's a ten. I I would wear that. That's great. What? Hold on, there's 200... <laughs> okay, we're not going for all of them. We're skipping through the more normal ones, I think. Like this, this is fairly, you know, it's... It does kind of look like she's just taken the uh, tablecloth off and just wrapped it round her. But, you know, that's slightly more normal. We're going to skip the normal ones and, you know, go on to Big Bird over here. <laughs> What's with the hat? What is with the hat? I feel like that looks like one of the caps that should have, like, the drinks and the straws. That would make this a better costume, a much better one. The four out of ten, just for the cap. You know, it, it, again, if it had the the two two bottles of drink, straws, it's it's a solid eight with that. Also, look at this bloke in the background. <laughs> it's all the hunchback of Notre Dame over there with his mask on. Fuck me, Stormzy mate, who's getting married? Who's getting married? Look at this. This is. You know what? White suit, sure, whatever. Why, why, why the cape? Is he the, is he the new Pope? Just stick one of them Pope hats on him, and this is Pope. This is next Pope. Um. <laughs> what? Is the moustache part of the costume? Is that the outfit? It should be outfit, really. But still, what, why, why is that there? Why is, uh, that's a 10 out of 10, just for that. I'm... That's great. Okay, do I... Am I... <laughs> am I seeing this right? Put a tie on him and he's a snooker player who's been in a car crash. He's got a tie on his head. Like, what's going on here? This is like what Lewis Hamilton does at home. He just runs around like this. Again, d d like... Is this something that you can just walk into off the streets? Is that what this is? These aren't celebrities. These are people walking in thinking this is a massive food bank. What is going on? I mean, guy on the right, just... he w This wasn't supposed to be his outfit. 100, that was supposed to go on someone, like, ten times bigger. Woman on the left looks like a school art project. Look at the hat. That's something you bring home from school, and it's got glue everywhere on it. That That's what that is. It's all horrendous. This is the one out of ten. That, that's a one. It, it It's terrible. Jesus, God, who just nabbed stuff from Tutankhamun's tomb? What the bloody hell? This is what they were looking for in the Uncharted movie. This is what they were expecting to find. God, I hope it wasn't a cold night. The, you know, Briggs is going right up there. You know, that's going to retract if uh, 
if it was a cold night. Jesus Christ. I'm, I'm giving up on rating some of these as well. Some of them I'm just taking the piss out of. Jesus Christ, you'd see her coming a mile off, wouldn't you? My God. Also, I'm noticing a bit of a pattern here. All of the guys seem to have trousers on that are way too big. Is that in? Is that a, is that a thing? I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get any of this. And I mean, come on. I'm I'm like a fashion guru. I mean, look at me. I mean, come on. What about this? Doesn't scream fashion. Why the long face? <laughs> that's not even taking the piss on the costume. That's just taking the piss out of them. But, you know, it's a terrible costume as well. Wow. I, I hope that's real. Hold on. Right, I need to look up this person to see if that's actually their hair or if this is a fucking big wig. Disappointing. It's a big wig. Cut, maybe. It's probably a big wig. That's very disappointing. God, what the fuck is this? It looks like an episode of Art Attack has just started. What's going on here? Again, right, again, look at the trousers. They're too big for him. That's what I looked like on the first day of secondary school. The trousers would have fit a year 11. I was a year 7 going in with them. Okay, I, I mean, she kind of looks like the, the fish, the, the female fish out of Shark Tale. But, you know, that aside, what the fuck? <laughs> Just, you know, members of the cult coming in, walking in front of a camera. It, it baffles me. This whole thing baffles me. It's great. It's fantastic. I love it. Okay, I mean, I don't have a whole lot to say about this. One, behind the mask could be Snoop Dogg, not a clue. Look how shiny the shoes are. But he's got the, the ultra shiny shoes and a pair of one pound socks that he found in Tesco. Look at them. What, is this, is this like, like very shiny chain mail? It looks like she's got the chain mail like head thing on. This looks like it's chain mail from out of fucking space. This is what the dark matter um, camo would look like if there was like a medieval Call of Duty. This is what it would look like. <laughs> okay, who is this? Bad bunny. Bad outfit? <laughs> Forget the bunny. I'm sorry. <laughs> in... 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 What? <laughs> this is this is this is woeful. This is woeful. Why is he taking the glasses off as well? He's holding the glasses. Those glasses would have helped, kind of. This is this just what your nan's walls look like? Everything is beige. It's all beige. <laughs> oh, we got Piers Morgan here. He's looking looking dapper again. <laughs> jeans. Slightly too big. They're way too long. <laughs> but hey, who am I to judge? That's, that's fashion for you. Oh, here's Elon Musk and his wife. Uh, <laughs> okay, she's just got up. She has just, just got up. I, like, look, that that is straight... Oh, I don't want to go to the Met Gala. I'm going to make a fall out of myself. I haven't slept. That's that look. Roll out the red carpet. Shalom is coming through. <laughs> what the fuck? What is this? Is this so she can just find her way home? Uh, love, um, uh, th there's a guy behind there trying to steal all of your jewels and your treasures. Um, you might want to might wanna do something about that. Uh, who, what, what's your name? Cody Smith McPhee. Well, Cody Smith McPhee, I've got some drains that are blocked. Do you want to come round and, and, and deal with them? Because you've got your rubber gloves on. You're ready. You're ready for this. Okay, again, it's probably part of the outfit, the bag. What have you got in there? I mean, it definitely isn't a fucking change of clothes. Look how small that bag is. It's so impractical. <laughs> Maybe she's got, like, the rest of her hair in there that have been cut off in a very tragic accident. Okay, so we've got all of them guys with trousers way too big for them, and then we've got this bloke. I mean, there's, they're too big width-wise, but look at them for swingers. I mean, I'm, I'm talking about the trousers, not, you know, not them. The trousers. Still, though, I would.
Look at this bloke here. I know he's not who we're looking at, but he's just walked in with his fucking feeler trainers. Okay, so we've got all of the snooker players, and now we've got the bloke who's there to put the balls back on the table. Look at this guy. That is a straight, I'm going to put your balls on the table kind of outfit. <laughs> this bloke's here looking like, the fuck's his arm gone? What's happened? <laughs> Is this guy dre- guy? Is it a guy? I don't know. Is he dressed up as the fucking throne from Game of Thrones? What in fuck's name? I feel like I defeated a creature in Elden Ring that looked like this. That's terrifying. I mean, he probably got an Uber there. Fucking terrified the driver. He walks in with his claws. <laughs> Take me to the Met Gun. <laughs> I mean, he's killing it. He looks like a fucking idiot, but he's killing it. <laughs> he's enjoying himself, and that's what matters. Oh, uh, okay, there's a, there's a lot going on here. She's got whatever the fuck this bag is, which looks like someone's shrunk down a, a suitcase. But also, she didn't have enough time to dry her hair before she got out. Jesus Christ, did she, like, run down some birds on the way in? It just looks like a bird massacre. There's zero thought put into this. It's like, right, let's go and buy that wedding dress from the charity shop. Cover it in red feathers. Cover it. And then sell it for thousands of pounds. That's what that is. I thought this was, like, a celebrity thing. <laughs> I thought this was for celebrities. Although, I don't know, she does kind of look a bit undercover. She snuck in as someone else. She, by the looks of it, she snuck in as Ross Kemp. Looks quite similar. Okay, I don't know what they're putting in them trousers, but whatever it is, it's working. <laughs> wow, look, the guy in the background is trying not to look. He's just like... <sighs> don't look, don't look. If you look at it, it will turn you to stone. <laughs> That's terrifying. Everything about this is terrifying. Okay, see, now we're, now we're taking the, the big trousers to an extreme. The, 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 this isn't a size. What size are you? Yes. Oh, the, look at this. This looks so uncomfortable. She knows it's uncomfortable. She's so unhappy. She doesn't want to be there. Look at this. This looks like it's made out of the shit that then blow up like kids' pools are made out of. I guess at least if she pisses herself, it's going to create a nice little swimming pool, though. So, you know, every cloud. God, is she being attacked by venom? Okay, either he's trying to sneak something in, or he has got some cake back there. No wonder these people are all trying to take pictures. They are looking at that and going, whoa. <laughs> Again, though, right, just as a thing, well, well, what does this do? What, what, why is it so bad for this guy just to wear the trousers, which are slightly too big, um, and just the jacket? Why is that so wrong? Or was it because, oh, well, the jacket's a bit long. Should we cut it down a bit, make it fit? Nah, now nah, it's fine. We'll just put some fucking, like, sheets of metal under there and hold it up. This isn't a fucking building job. You don't need to hold his jacket up with scaffolding. Okay, it, uh, did, <laughs> did this guy like lose his fingers in some tragic accident and because he's rich he managed to get some like crazy golden bionic ones or is that part of the costume because he looks like a school child i like it i want these i want i want your fingers <laughs> what's his name M melissa wait melissa is that a woman is miss okay uh she's opening the right okay so it, it it's whatever the fuck that's what that's what she is he i don't fucking know <laughs> Okay, right. Uh, in this situation, I don't know who is being held hostage out of either of these. They both look like they are being completely forced to do this. She is really staring. I feel like she's going to be behind. And he is, is straight up just terrified. Okay, this is the last one. This is number 217. And my days are they save best till last. Look at this. He looks like he should be in an old carry-on film. What's this little hat? Oh, who, who are you? Hamish Bowles. Well, Hamish, I think you top this off very, very well. That is great. I, 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 I like this. I, I kind of intrigued as to why he's got two hats. He's got 
whatever the fuck that one is, and he's holding his other one. I think the other one would definitely suit more. But yes, that is going to be it for this video. Um, some some interesting, some interesting looks. Um, certainly nothing I would go for personally. But you know, each to their own. I'm much more of a this kind of guy. You know, it's can't pull them up too tight. We'll uh, we'll get the video taken down. But you know. It's, uh, they won't allow me on the Met Gala though. I look like a fucking idiot, but because I'm not rich, I won't be allowed there. But yes, that is going to be it from me. If you have enjoyed this video, then do remember to leave a like. And if you are new around here as well, remember to subscribe to keep up to date with some of the content uh, that we'll be putting out. And yes, that will be it for me. Thank you very much for watching, and I shall see you in the next video. Goodbye.